I'm here at Sayudo's in Midtown with Tuana Hines, and she just got a cupcake. Uh, I recommend that she come here because they have really large cupcakes. And when I mentioned, I was bummed. <laughs> When I mentioned to Rachel that I was going to get a cupcake, but I felt guilty about it, I said, oh my god, I'm going to get a cupcake. But I felt really guilty because I still need to like lose weight, you know, because summertime. You did not need to lose weight. And Rachel goes, why the hell are you eating a cupcake? <laughs> I'm like, they're good. I wasn't trying to discourage you from eating a cupcake. I no, just, no, she's pro-cupcake. She's all I'm about totally pro-cupcake. I just... Even I am not going to lie, I don't think cupcakes can help you lose weight. But I think they're awesome. And these I are really good. And also, there. we are on are 8th Avenue and 30th, between 30th and 31st. And I don't really think there are that many other places to get cupcakes near here that I know of. So if you're like Midtown West and you need a cupcake, you can always come here and get one. Or you Maybe could I walk down... like my impression so far. You could walk down to Chelsea. For Billy. Yeah. Okay, wait. Um, okay. Can I be honest about my impression of cupcakes so far? Okay. So far, you haven't even eaten it. Well, no. <laughs> because look, all of it goes together. The aesthetics, like okay, all right. Like this here, that's overcooked. That's overcooked. Okay. Yeah. Because look, that's like hard. Too hard. Yeah. Okay. And so what I, what I'll do here is like I'm literally gonna. You're gonna peel it away. I'm gonna peel away the muffin. It's top like when you have a sunburn and you get too burned and you peel off the skin. Wait, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll try another cupcake then. I'll take your word for it on that one. And, um, alright. Yeah, okay. And see when it crumbles like that? Yeah, you know, yeah. I will say, I've only ever had their chocolate chocolate ones. They're really good. But this is tasty. Like, this is this mouth-watering, you might say. It's very good. Is that how you usually eat them, or do you eat them? I'm curious. When they're this big? What I usually do, everybody's got cupcake eating techniques when they're this big, like big enough that I can't put my whole like mouth on it. Wait, try to do that. <laughs> when it's too big to put my whole mouth on it, what I do is I break away about half. This is gonna make me seem totally neurotic. No, you take but off part of the bottom so you can eat it. I as take a the half, like the bottom half of it off and I eat it. So then I can chomp. Like I can't get my mouth on the whole cupcake, but I can get my mouth on half. So what I'll do is I'll like take off parts of the bottom, sample it, and then when I'm ready to chop, I can just chop on top. That totally makes sense. So then you can like have a whole like full in the mouth kind of thing. Right. That totally makes sense. So. They're good because they include a napkin. Nothing more annoying than going someplace with cupcakes and they don't have a napkin. What? <laughs> that was just me trying to be subtle <laughs> and ask you. <laughs> oh. Good? Yeah. I like it. You I like, like it? Cupcakes. Good. Good. If I had to give it a grade, as far as moistness, I'd give it like a C minus, C plus, you know? Mm -hmm. um, frosting, just cut it. A minus, solid B plus, like good frosting. Sprinkles, but they didn't go overboard with it. It's buttercream frosting, but without being too like slimy, too slick. Sometimes buttercream gets to be a bit much. But what's bringing this cupcake value down is that it's too dry. Too dry. Too dry and overcooked. Yeah. Okay. So, that's my value. Well, thank you.